Three. Hi, I'm Debbie. I'm going to help you to understand how to uh, lay out your permanent growth plot. <clears throat> One of the first things that you need to do is to uh, put the, um, the tags on the tree properly. So first of all, we're going to number the tag and you just use your pencil on it and you're just going to number this one is going to be called 001. And then um, when you put it in the tree, uh, you have to put it on an angle that's facing downward so that you're not going to um, impede the growth of the tree by the nail uh, getting um, grown over um, by the tree. You always want to put the tag up higher than breast height. You know um, that breast height is 1.3 meters and you're going to angle it facing down. And you try really hard not to bend the nail when you're putting it in. And some trees are better for the bending part than others. You want the, um, the tag to hang away from the tree with the number out and facing the center post. So all the, all the numbering should be clearly visible when you're standing at the center post. Um, you want to make sure too that you've got a couple of fingers distance away from the tree after the nail is, uh, is put into the tree. Okay? Now, if you have a small tree that you're working with, you won't be putting a nail in it. You'll be using some of this um, tube marking paint and this is a really fun thing to do because it's really messy and it takes a long time to dry so you need to be really careful with it and you don't want to put too much of it on and don't paint each other with it either <clears throat> the specs for um, doing the painting on a tree is if uh, the tree is less than um, three centimeters, I think. I'm not sure what the, the total uh, number of centimeters is. And the uh, best thing to do is to um, make sure that your diameter tape is being read from the correct side and that you can read the numbers when you're putting it around the tree. So. This tree is 2.9 centimeters in size, so it's too small to put a nail in, so we're going to number it with the marking paint. So you do that by carefully putting the numbers on the tree by squeezing the tube like that. So that would be tree number two in this plot. <clears throat> 